If your lift will not retract out of the water, and this is an emergency situation, contact 911. If not, try the following steps. First, take a small pen and push the emergency button on the control box. This should retract your lift to deck position, indicating you may need to replace your remote handset. Please call customer service. If your lift does not retract, check your connections. Unplug the handset cable and actuator cable from the control box. Reinsert the cables into the control box using the palm of your hand. These are watertight connections and can be stubborn. Also, make sure your battery is properly connected to your lift. The battery will click into place when it is properly connected to the control box. Now try operating your lift. If the lift still does not operate, you will need to check the voltage on your charger and battery. To check the charger, make sure the charger is plugged in. Using your voltmeter, place the prongs on the charger terminals. A good charger will read around 27 volts or more. If your charger reads below 27 volts, it needs to be replaced. If your charger has proper voltage and your lift still doesn't work, you'll need to check the battery voltage. Remove the battery from your lift. Using a voltmeter, place the prongs on the two terminal tabs. A fully charged battery should read 25 volts or higher. If your battery is reading below 25 volts, place it on the charger for 24 hours and check again. If your battery still does not increase in voltage, your battery needs to be replaced. Please call our customer service.